<clears throat> just don't remember what you were going to say about, like, the hero's journey. Yeah. Oh, shit. Open halls are dangerous. <laughs> don't know what that means. But okay, tell me what about the hero's journey or what you think about it. Was anything to do with leprechauns? That tower shield could be used for a future uh, build, by the way. It also means that I don't necessarily need to start with the fighter class because <clears throat> not all dungeons will give you a shield, but this one gives you some pretty good shield options, so I can change the train the shield skill later on. And then the, we want... Like you're taking you're taking a while to talk, so like I, I'm narrating the game while I play, but I can stop my turns. But like the next thing I was gonna say is gonna kind of fucked up. But like in this game, I have really really high evasion, but there are some attacks that that ignore evasion, and uh, what if it's got my battery levels? And I have to kill those. I have to kill them first. No matter what their class is. Oh, shit. And there's, like... It's a priest class. I, like, there's orcs. I have to kill the orc priests first. They're, like, my absolute first priority. Yeah. Yeah, because they can smite me. And I can't evade a smite. And they have... They have, like, groups of orc priests. Like, I can get, like, multi-smited. Like, I was kind of flipping through this like I was a badass and nothing could stop me. And then I started getting fucking mass smited and I almost died a few times. Which would really suck because this character was really hard to build. <clears throat> but I'm also narrating for the YouTube folks. So we're, 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 we're alive. We're alive. I grained game screen recorder. <laughs> Shameless plug for some of I need to focus on getting the fuck away from this thing. I've been like like luring the groups in, using my speed to bait them. Yeah, well, no, everything's bob. No, basically everything in this dungeon is. Oh shit! I don't want to get crapped in this cave. Everything is in this dungeon is peaceful. They're just like living in their home. And they're just like, there's this orb, there's this fabled orb of Zop, orb of Zob or whatever at the bottom, which I've never seen because I've never gotten to the bottom. And yeah, I basically just come in here and murder everything for their experiments and gold and equipment. <laughs> I was a real monster. Speaking of which, I have to go murder those fucking priests somehow. <laughs> There's an orc warrior. He's not. He's not paying quite attention to me, and I'm fast. <laughs> the race I am. They're really. They're really, really small, but they're really fucking fast and hard to hit. So like, I, so, like, they get broken up into groups and shit trying to find me. They're really stealthy. I just fucking pop out of nowhere, fucking stab them to death. This is not going to look good on you. <laughs> oh, this going to be funny, though. Oh, fuck. Time to go in berserk. Because cause my, uh, my Spriggan, they're really good at magic, and they're really bad at me in combat. So you know what I did? Made him a berserker of Trog who hates magic. He's just he's like the sprinkin who can't use magic. But I 
I can um I can go berserk. And I can use my magic, which is my spellcrafting skill, my spellcasting skill as as hit points to compensate for my uh really really so I basically have average hit points, but like really high speed. And I have really good regeneration. And when I yeah, I just killed those two priests and like once I but there was the high priest he he is not around. No, there he is. He just smited me. And I just took a lot of damage, but my MP absorbed it too. And there's another priest behind him, so it's like can I close the distance? I'm already a berserk. Gonna run away. Probably a good move because like also, if I get shot with an arrow, I can evade most of them. But if one of them hits me, it could be very lethal. <clears throat> but I have to wait for the uh, Berserk to recharge. Catch my breath. Wait. Huh? To recharge? How long does that take? Oh, long enough to die. I could probably kill him without it. He's the only one. Yeah. I can absorb a smite or two. <laughs> His belief is not enough to kill this kill this little fiery uh Yeah, once they split up when they're in a one tight group, they're really, really like dangerous, but once they split up I can like hit and run them. This guy might be really fucking dangerous. You know what? Fuck this guy. Uh, I'm going to go to my Vorpal Sling. And uh, see what time is. Seven minutes. What about the hero's journey, though? He said it was, like, old or outdated and shit. Yeah, so what do you, do you defend that position? Probably too late. I probably took too long. Yeah, I don't know. You you was in the moment, and then I started, I was like, "Hey, wait, let me let me smoke some weed." Yeah, you know, so I fucked it up. Cause you sound like you was falling asleep now, so it don't matter. The hero's journey. Can I shoot things? Nope. Fuck sakes, man. This guy won't. This guy is hard to kill. I don't want to fuck with that axe. He's got a big fucking axe. He's in plate armor. I don't want to. He's fucking me up, man. About 29%. Damn. Good evasion. He looks, he looks dangerous. Up to 42% damage with its Vorpal weapon. 42 damage. I can take a few hits. We're about to fuck this motherfucker up. No, I don't. No, thank you, game AI. <laughs> I feel clever. He literally says, I feel clever. Yes, I do feel clever for, for putting away my fucking sling before going to certain fucking close range and not pulling out this plus seven, plus seven rapier, which is going to hopefully punch it through his armor. I do feel clever. Berserk. That motherfucker died. That motherfucker died. It's like that song. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah. It was an orc night. It was a boss battle. Hey, it's nine. It's at. It's about the ten minute mark. That was perfect. And it's perfect close time. 
boss battle. 